Today, 5th of July 2016, is the 175th anniversary of Thomas Cook. It was on this day, the 5th of July, in 1841, that Thomas Cook organised his very first excursion, a 12-mile rail journey from Leicester to Loughborough. Uh, and that, that is day one. We take that as day one of the company. And today we are organising a very special excursion by steam train on the Great Central Railway. We're going to take a whole group of uh, specially invited guests, VIPs, local dignitaries, uh, local school children, Thomas Cook staff. We're going to take them on a special journey from Leicester to Loughborough and back again. Um, and they're going to have a Victorian experience. So there are going to be people in costume um, and playing games with the children. There's a special exhibition on here as well at, uh, at Loughborough Station. Uh, there are going to be some speeches and there will be food served on the train and there'll be a special lemonade stand on the station as well. Well, it's been really great today because, uh, of course, Thomas Cook have recreated the steam journey, but they've also provided things from the period when that first journey was made. We've got people here who are actually dressed up as if they were from that period and are carrying on Thomas Cook's message that travel is fun and vitally important. What inspires me about working for Thomas Cook is of course the long heritage of the company. I mean the founder himself was a really inspiring man, a real entrepreneur who started so many things that still survive till today in modern tourism. Well, I'm inspired to work with Thomas Cook because of its uh, 175 year brand heritage. It's, uh, brand that's known all over the globe amongst travel people. When I visit China, Thomas Cook name comes up, uh, as it does when you speak people in the UK or on the continent. So that's inspiring to know that the name is well recognized among people. And, you know, as a director of Thomas Cook, I feel as if I'm a custodian of that brand heritage. Overall, we hope that everybody who's here today will have a Victorian experience and this will you know, bring to life uh, what it was like for Thomas Cook's very first customers back on the 5th of July, 1841.